New York and Christmas is really special, but I'm never coming back. <laughs> Hi, so we are getting ready to go to New York for the weekend for Christmas activities and to meet up with one of my friends. Um, so I'm going to show you what we are packing um, for our trip. Mostly me, well, I pack for myself and my daughter. Husband packs for himself, so I'm going to show you what I'm taking with us and how we're going to be prepared for the cold weather because even though we're so close, this is only about four or three hours, three to four hours from New York. New York tends to be colder because of the tall buildings. They kind of funnel the wind. And we're going to be outside a lot, which, you know, when we're home, we're not outside during winter all the time. So since we're going to be home a lot, I mean, outside a lot, we need more layers. So here is what we are packing. All right, so here we have a small carry-on. It's not the full-size carry-on because we're only going for the weekend. And here's what I have. Um, so this is just a white short dress I'm taking with me. Um, I've got a pair of white cropped pants. But the most important parts are these. This is um, Heat Tech, which is what I'm taking with me. These are Heat Tech leggings. It's gonna be worn underneath of these white pants. And then I have these Heat Tech tops. These are turtlenecks. One like not turtleneck, I guess, and white turtleneck. <laughs> um, they're really important because it's so good for layering, and I don't want a lot of bulky pieces, so that's what I'm bringing for that. So, possibly the most important thing that I'm gonna bring are these snowboarding socks, <laughs> um, which I have linked below. Um, I've, I have several pairs, I don't just have this one, I have like 10 pairs of these because I actually do snowboard and the socks for snowboarding are probably the best for winter and my feet just always get cold. So I have these for my daughter and for my husband, I got them for them last year because it was really cold in DC last year so and my feet always get cold so I've got these, I've linked these below, I've also linked the heat tech that I usually wear below. Um, so I don't just get, I don't get the ultra warm, I guess it's called. I get the regular kind. So I've linked it all below. And um, it's not just for Christmas. Cause I, I went to New York, I think this year earlier in January, also really cold, but of course I had all my heat tech on me. <laughs> and I was wearing this thin little reformation dress, but I had all this heat tech on, so I wasn't cold at all. And it was like maybe forties during the day. And then like I think thirties at night. So it wasn't terribly cold, but it was still cold. And yes, I am packing my Stora Weissman over-the-knee boots. Yes, because um, I found that when you wear over-the-knee boots over your leggings, it's so much warmer. Whatever is covered by the over-the-knee boot, especially the real leather, and the Stora Weissmans are real leather. Um, it's like wearing leather pants without the tightness of it, I guess, on the top part. But these boots are awesome. These are the Lowlands um, that I have in this bag. I already put them in the bag, in the dust bag. So I'll also link them below. They're actually, um, I think, on sale now. So they're not that expensive. But these will keep your legs really warm when you're wearing like either leggings or like the tights under like that white dress I have packed. And to go with that dress, I have these tech leggings. They don't look like much, but they do look really warm, especially if you layer them some. So the Heat Tech um, leggings, I just get the normal ones. They run, like, not small, but short. I get holes on the toe part, so I would get a larger size just for the length, and I'm not even that tall, so if you're above, like, 5'4", I would say get the medium-large versus the small-medium. Next, I have my daughter's stuff to pack. I'm packing these new boots I got her. Um, also, I like to use these bags. They're like laundry bags to separate our clothes and put like underwear and socks in. So and then for her I have these plushy leggings also because it's cold so these are really warm. And then I have a really thick pair for when we go out at night if we're walking around at like what's it called? Um Rockefeller Center. And these are like super plushy. They're like really thick and warm. So I'll link those below as well, if you have kids. They're from Amazon. <laughs> toiletries and makeup are already packed. I don't usually, I just have a to-go bag for toiletries. And then a to-go bag for makeup. This is probably more makeup than I need. Um, usually I'll 
This is for a longer trip. Usually for a weekend I'll take like three things, but I don't feel like I'm packing it, so I'm gonna take it as is. Put it in there, and then I think once it's done, I might. Oh, I'm gonna bring one pretty going out dress just in case we go somewhere nice for dinner. This is like a this is a new dress I got um, from Danny Joe. It's like a silk slip dress. I really love the color, so I'm gonna bring that. Oh yeah, and I bought this gold belt too. It just came from Amazon today. I linked it below. I linked the dress below too. If you wanna look at it. Um, so this is gonna go with the dress. I think that's it. I might put some gold jewelry on it. I think we're good to go. Then I'm going to bring some hair clips just to kind of like dress up like pretty much all white wardrobe at this point. <laughs> Hello, New York. Morning. Don't get me. What about you? Me too. Say hi. Good morning. Hi. Good morning. <laughs> Since mommy's late, I'm just have to be pooped. <laughs> Jesse's crazy. Ow! Ah! I found the apple. <laughs> Mommy's gonna get off the table now. Okay, fine. Is it where? Yeah. Why? Next is snack bag. Okay. Next is snack bag. <laughs> but I don't snack bag. Do I say next is snack bag? I'm gonna have some snack. <laughs> For our first day in New York. And it's almost just like Thailand. <laughs> yes. Looks only match. So many tall buildings. Mm, yes. Hi. First outfit of the day. Boots, white dress and coat. A lot of stuff underneath. <laughs> Fun. This is the morning time. All right, let's go. Some croissants. Put your coat on. Yay. Look, we match them. No, uninterested. We made it. We agree. What are we getting? What do you want for breakfast? What do you want for breakfast? Huh? What do you want? You want croissant? Oh. Let's see, trying to decide. Oh, they do have a lot of stuff. Oh man, don't they have like a regular croissant? I think we'll just get a regular croissant. Don't, give me one. <laughs> you like your croissant? Let me see. Ah. Oh, yum yum. <laughs> How about it? How about it? Give me a hot soup. Give me a tag. Thank First day in New York, we are headed down to do Santa experience at Macy's and we're doing, um, what is it called? Oh, we're gonna go head to Brea Park and check out the Christmas market and do some ice skating. So we walk from our hotel. It's like 18 blocks down. It's 
kind of chilly, but it's okay. Here. I'm like for <laughs> So the toddlers are now being carried because they can't walk that fast <laughs> or that far. I just got carried. So, so. Are they holding hands? <laughs> They're holding hands while being carried. Let me light it for you. Somebody is getting a girly breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> taking, oops, taking some really old escalator. Squeak, squeak, squeak. <laughs> the line at Macy's Santa experience. The same. Look at this. So long and insane. Whoa. Snow globe. So cool. Yeah. <laughs> 